Hello, this is Chaos Blue, and welcome to more Let's Play Final Fantasy VI! The w the intro where I don't screw up edition. Although I only screwed up a little bit. Um, anyway, we are here. We're not going to be here for very long. But we didn't skip over it because this happens. What happened? That's what I want to know. The espers all flew off together. The Imperials all ran off too, as if they were afraid of something. Which way did the Espers go? Towards the Imperial Capital! I see. I see. We are almost to Vector. What's what? rut -row. What is wrong, Terra? You can feel what? What's getting closer? Um... I have a bad feeling. What are the Espers doing? Are they about to kill us all? Please tell me they're not about to kill us all. They're coming this way. Hopefully not to kill- that's, uh, Esper, alright. Bahamut by the looks of things. Oh, that wasn't Bahamut though. Yeah, that's, that's what it looks like. That's what I want to know. Why are they trying to kill me? You mustn't go where? Good question. We're in an airship, so... Um... Ugh... It seems we're going down. And everyone died. Or not. Really, considering that crash landing, the airship is in remarkably good shape. I mean, it's still a one piece, for crying out loud. Anyway. Anyway. Where are we? is the important question. Way over by Miranda. Okay, so, here's the thing. At this point, we need to go to Vector. We're gonna need to walk there. I'm not gonna show you walking there. <laughs> Because we've done that before. It's a long trip, and a fairly uneventful one. Plus also, I need to change my party up a little bit. So, well, I'll meet you there. 
See you in a few minutes. Welcome to Vector, and... Oh. This place has seen better days. But hey, returners! Yay! Um... I mean, this house is on fire, but... You know, she still heals us for free, so that's nice. Um... My... Oh my... That's what I want to know! No one knows what's going on, it's clear. Hmm... Bannon is here, and he doesn't know what it happened either. Did the Espers do this? No, they couldn't have! It was like this when we got here. That's... kinda awful. Well, no one's trying to kill us yet, that's a good sign. The Emperor is, is expecting you. This way, please. Oh, I guess I'm not on automatic. Okay then. Right this way. Oh. Before I continue, I should point something out. I have Sabin instead of Gal right now. Because I get a little extra dialogue this way. Plus also, he'll come in handy for what's coming up in a minute. I also gave Locke a pair of sprint shoes, which I generally haven't been using. But... As... But I sort of want them for this section. Sabin is not going to be in the party for very long, in case you were worried about that. Or if you want him to be in the party, then... Well, oh well. He isn't going to be for very long. I have lost my will to fight. That's completely the wrong voice. Not for really what I wanted to go for Gestalt either. I want more like a... Mm, more nasally and... Let's go with that. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> the Emperor had a change of heart. Sid, you're not dead yet! The Espers came to save their friends! When they learned that none of them were alive, they ravaged the entire city! I'll never forget their shrieks of rage! We're hanging up our weapons for good. The war is over! The power of those espers! I had no idea! None! Oh, woe is me! I definitely didn't murder your mother or anything! They'll destroy the entire world if we don't do something! We're utterly helpless against them! We must find a way to calm their rage. Men should never lust after power. They lack a means to control. Remember that. Friends! Let us speak tonight. More over dinner. Tonight. There's still some soldiers who would prefer- Ah, uh, you know, I'm screwing the voices a lot right now. I don't care, okay? My throat is- well, I'm not really coughing much anymore, but I don't want to push it, or else I will start having coughing fits again. So, you know, hopefully we don't need to deal with Kefka. <laughs> anyway. Soldiers, right. So here's the thing with this. There are 24 soldiers in total. I'm saying this now because we're about to get, get a timer, and we're going to want to talk to all of them. 
We can afford to miss one or two, probably, but we need to be careful. Because we get rewards if we do this section correctly, and I want the good rewards. Therefore, well, sprint shoes, for one thing. So, we don't need to talk to these two assholes. Fortunately. Move! But we do want to talk to these two. Then for Prince Kefka, after learning everything he does, and the Kefka made The war is over. Ah! Yep. They did. Lost the will to fight. Good to know. No, that's where Kefka is. We're not going in there. The library! Soldier! This is ridiculous! Do you count? Yes. Okay, there's items around the place, but we can pick those up later. So, I'm gonna do that after this, pick them all up after this sequence. So as to conserve a few extra seconds. Up we go. And out on side the top. I lost my whole family in the war. Kafka's been thrown in jail. The war ended before I got a chance to use this thing. Ah! Why do I have joined the Oh Yeah. There's three of soldiers you fight like this, I believe. Um, you'll notice the timer is still running. We get an extra... I believe you get extra points for beating these soldiers. You don't actually need to fight them, but you lose points if you don't. Although, it'll say you talk to them in either, either case. Whether you actually beat them or not. But you, you need to beat them to get the full points. Talk to them. You're next. Wait, is there a door here? Shit. No, wait, no, that's where I what came in. Or, that's where I go down, rather. Okay. No, we're making good time, though. Next up is in here, which is... Da -da -da -da, the dormitory! There's a lot of people in here. Kefka's locked up. I wonder if Aspers came to rescue their friends. Probably. Yep, he's doing that alright. No, I already talked to you! Oh, and this guy's fighting us. Blitz! Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up! Damn straight, not bad. Out of the way! Yeah, it will be. Talk to this guy. Did he just say pop on peace? Poop on peace? I think he said poop on peace. I mean, he is in a toilet, so that would actually kind of make sense. Hmm. Anyway. Anyway... Yeah, no kidding. Okay, only three more to go. And we're actually making really good time. This is actually a lot- No! Get out of the fucking door! Ah! Okay. This is actually a lot easier to do in this version of the game. It's worth saying. Is there anything in here? No, just items. But yeah, it's easier to do in this version of the game because you go a lot faster with the boots. I've killed too many people. I can never live a normal life. Haha. -ha. Wait, no, that's a bad thing. Yeah, I am. Oh, wait. <laughs> now you're fighting us too. Doesn't matter, because I have Blitz. Or it's here. Ha! -ha! Well, I was saying, right. The thing is... 
because you your run speed, even with sprint shoes, is significantly slower in the other... Well, not the other version of the, of the game. Specifically... Oh, that was all 24. Specifically in the uh, Super Nintendo version of the game, compared to the other ones. Because in the sequel versions, you get a run command even if you don't don't have sprint shoes, and, you, and it doubles your speed when you have them equipped in. Yeah, so we're done. We just sort of need to wait around for 50 minutes. Minutes? No, 50 seconds. I kind of wish I could, you know, sit in this properly. No, it's not going to let me. They are Imperial Guards, so, you know, whatever. Oh, you know what? We have time to go talk to Kefka, so let's do that. Because why not? Welcome to the prison, which has Kefka. Yeah! How dare they put me in a place like this! Ha! Huh! I just can't believe it! Yeah, Kefka just wastes your time. A lot. What a bore! So don't talk to him unless you have ex a whole lot of extra time. That evening, a banquet was held it within... Or no, with the Emperor. I guess it is also within the Empire, but anyway. So this part, we need to say the right things to maximize our point gain. I'm going to do all the commands that give you the most points, but I encourage you to play around with this. Just like I said, I want the max rewards. Even though, strictly speaking, I don't really need them. I'll sit with the returners, if that's alright. This episode's probably going to be a little bit on the long side, by the way. Um, although I don't know how long, because there's a pretty big cut in walking to Vector in the first place, but I'm not going to stop until I finish the banquet. In any case. <coughs> in any case. Ahem. <laughs> At last, we can all be together, sharing a meal. At the same table, let us make a toast. Who? What? Shall we raise our glasses? To our homelands is the best option. Well then, to our homelands! Generally, you want to pick the options that uh, favor a middle ground between the Empire and the Returners. As you may know, I've imprisoned Kefka for his crime of using poison against Doma. What do you think should be done with him? Leave him in jail. I see. Well, let's let him stew in his cell for a while. Then we can see... Then we can decide what to do. I am truly sorry about what occurred in Toma. No one ever dreamed Kefka would use poison. It was inexcusable. I am terribly sorry for what was done. I promise to punish Kefka severely and to work to eradicate poisons all over the world. By the way, with regards to General Celez, Celez is one of us! Kefka was lying! Indeed, she was one of us. And yet you still doubted her, you bastard. General Celez realized the lunacy of this war 
long before I did and went over to your side. That is, she went over to your side. Clever wording there, but you aren't going to be tricking anyone. Okay, this part is a little bit different. All of these give you the same amount, and you can ask all of them, but if you ask the same one more than once, then you lose points. Why did we have to talk to your men? Some of my men still do not believe we should have ended the war. I felt they might better understand if they could meet you face to face. Yeah, we're gonna do this twice more, or one more time, because we want to ask each of these questions. Again, though, if we repeat something, then we lose points. But we need to max out our points, which means we need to ask all of the, all three. Because I now believe that working together is our only hope. Yeah, one more thing. It was all the result of my foolish lust for power. I've come to my senses now. Then again, you would say that, wouldn't you? Okay, let's talk about the espers. The Empire has been decimated by the espers that emerge from the sealed gate. They're just too powerful. If we don't do something, they'll tear the entire world apart. Um, yeah, I think it's fair to say they've gone a little too far. When the espers came through on their rampage, all of my ambitions faded in an instant. Now I find myself asking why I ever wanted that much power in the first place. Of course, there's no excuse for the atrocities I committed in the name of conquest. Um, It was this one. This is an important one. Don't answer wrong. You get points for answering correctly. Right. Anyway, I truly desire peace. I want you to understand that. I truly understand that you want us to think that you truly desire peace. Um... Hmm... Yeah, okay, we can take a break. Sure. Two minutes, three soldiers. And we want to make sure we take him out of the time limit, because we get, uh... Well, we get points for beating them within the time frame. Allotted. I don't think we'll have any t problem with it, personally. No, Sabin, you're supposed to attack the other one! Oh well. Sian can probably just one-shot it, so... Or that could happen. That works, too! You can only fight them if you make a break. Um... Yeah, I think it's... Okay. Now we just need to return to our seats. Resume! Is there anything you wish to hear me say? There is one thing that comes to mind. That your war is truly over. All right, I swear right here and now that there will be no more fighting. And now, I have a favor to ask. Hmm. 
they attacked us. After they attacked us, the Espers flew northward towards Crescent Island. Wait, Crescent Island? Again? We have no way of knowing when they'll decide to go on another rampage. We need to find them and convince them to set aside their aggression before that happens. But considering all that the Empire has done to them, I doubt they'll be willing to listen to us. That's why I need to borrow Terra's power. Terra is the only one who can bridge the gap between human and Esper. I have a magic armor transport ship moored in the port of Albrook. I had hoped to send it to Crescent Island with all haste. Uh, this is a but not must situation, however you lose points if you don't say yes immediately. S therefore, say yes immediately. I will have my top general send some of his troops to accompany you as well. General Leo! I am General Leo, pleased to make your acquaintance. Didn't I see that guy in Doma? Oh right, he was the one with principles. Harsh, but true. So, that's General Leo, eh? Isn't that Xi'an, retainer to the King of Doma? Please, forgive me for not being able to stop Kefka. What happened was not your fault. I'll be waiting for you in Albrook. Please find the Espers and convince them to cease their attacks. You're our only hope. If Terra goes, I go. Luck. Thank you. The rest of you stay here. I smell a rat. As do I. It's hard to trust the Emperor just like that. We will remain here and watch for anything out of the ordinary. Thanks. You'll be our eyes and ears. Keep your guard up. You be careful too. Okay, it's just the two of us. So, we're almost done now. But I really need to find... Okay, where the hell is the soldier? Um... <laughs> I guess I'll just go this way. Oh, here it is. I bear a message from the Emperor! Due to your decorum at tonight's banquet, and your grace in speaking to our soldiers beforehand, the Emperor has decided upon the following. All Imperial troops will be withdrawn from South Figaro immediately. In addition, Imperial forces will be withdrawn from the Kingdom of Doma. Furthermore, we will also unlock the armory at the Imperial Observation Post for our leisure and raiding. Indeed. As well, here is a personal gift. 
And another one! Ha ha! That means we aced it! it. Now, except for the last one, it's not too hard to get all of these. But that last one has extremely little room for error. Of a maximum, according to the wiki anyway, of a maximum 93 points, we need 90. And most dialogue options in that we just did are were worth 5 points. Meaning that a single poorly chosen answer would have been enough to deny us the ward bangle. That said... Cool. Okay, so here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna run around here off screen to pick the items. Um, I'll tell you right now. The only ones of note are a Gale hairpin, an alarm earring, which is a status effect item, or relic, and an X potion. Plus, there's a few other consumables that are kind of map. But yeah, those are the only items, and I don't remember what the Gale earring does, to be honest, so I'll show you that next time. But in any case, I'm gonna do that off screen. Then, when I join you next time, we're gonna be in Albrook. Probably. Um, so. That's the plan, basically. Until next time, this has been Let's... Actually, no, that's not true. I'll meet you in the Imperial Observation Post, not Albra. Uh, I digress, though. Until next time, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy VI with Chaos Baloo, and have a good day.